Well, you know, Basi shoved spaghetti down my throat, and before it's cooked, uh, that would be the equivalent of Dukes. <laughs> um, that is a perfect opportunity to say that this Thursday at my poetry reading, which is an open mic, um, Orion is our feature. Yeah. Um, Orion has been on the circuit for, I mean, oh, far longer than I have, but somehow I ended an MC for, ended up being an MC first. Um, so I wanted to feature Orion very badly, and I finally like just did it. Uh, so I encourage everybody to attend um, for Orion and give him a hand. Right. That's on. Uh, that's on Thursday night at 7:30 on uh, La, Lila, La Lida Java. Uh, get your pens and pencils out. It's on Third Street between B and C, right on the corner there. And we are in the poetry calendar under the uh, calendar under the title "Hot Butt Naked Sex" this week. <laughs> Worm delights are pygmies made of apples and oranges. Gone towards the fastest freeway. Oh, I'd like my gore to spit it and have it photographed as art. We fornicate like dogs and then tell dogs to sit, stand, beg, art. For what reason are we mortals when hygiene is not as important as fish and grain for a boil on my arm? Your systematic grunging has no repetition except in the yodels and booms of holy highnesses. Born are the fish and tracks led to my home. I have no eggs left for you, my green antelope. I have no more trees. John Chisholm wore a wig on the first thing night. True. That is true. John Chisholm, that was the Halloween party. He dressed up as uh, Howard Stern. Did she shove spaghetti down your throat that night? It means that John Chisholm has the entire scope. Tr all right. John well, thank you, Orion. <laughs> okay. That's the thing anyone's ever said to me. 